Good morning, wrestling fans. Today is Thursday, March 21st, 2024. Lance Brack here. Ready to talk some pro wrestling. Hope everyone is having a great Thursday morning so far. I apologize if I sound a little stuffy, my nose all stuffed up, my head all stuffed up, and I also apologize if I sniffle a little bit. This morning, it's a little cold outside walking to work, but luckily no snow. I had a few flurries yesterday, and In case you missed it last night, there was a new episode of 360 Wrestling Fanatic. And that's something else I want to apologize about. I noticed that during the episode, I believe I called it episode 569. But actually, it was episode 570. So accidentally made that mistake during the podcast last night. I apologize for that error. And speaking of last night's episode of 360 Wrestling Fanatic talk all about last night's AEW Dynamite and Rampage special Wednesday night episode of Rampage which was live from Toronto, Ontario Canada at the Coca-Cola Coliseum which in the main event last night we saw a new AEW TNT champion crowned In the I Quit match, the Rated R Superstar, Adam Copeland, defeating the Patriarchy, Christian Cage, in uh, what was expected and was a brutal, hardcore I Quit match, of course, which involved them going to the penalty box. And putting on hockey jerseys. And a hockey stick was involved as well. The Patriarch. Nick Wayne and Killswitch did get involved. But then Adam Copeland had Daniel Garcia... And Daddy Magic, Matt Menard as some backup. The finish saw the three of them handcuff Nick Wayne. <coughs> Excuse me. And kill switch in the corners of the ring. Adam Copeland about to use his new weapon known as Spike on Christian Cage and at that time Christian said I quit into the microphone so now Adam Copeland now a two time AEW TNT champion and this second reign has already lasted a lot longer way longer than the first reign Of course, if you remember, that's when he won. And then, right after the match, Killswitch cashed in his title shot. And then gave the title to Christian Cage. That was not the only brutal, hardcore type kind of match we saw last night on Rampage. We saw the women's tag team street fight 
with the AEW Women's World Champion Timeless Tony Storm and Mariah May defeating the team of Chris Stepander and Willow Nightingale in the street fight. Which this one actually had some pretty brutal hardcore spots as well. So pretty good match there. Also last night at the beginning of Dynamite actually when Mercedes Monet was interviewed by Tony Schiavone in the middle of the ring. Tony Storm and Mariah May came out and which led or no, not them, sorry. Julie, I don't know why I said them. I I definitely messed that up. They lost to Julia Hart and Sky Blue. I have no idea where I got that from. I, I'm not with it this morning. Like I said, my nose and my head are all stuffed up. Also, I don't have my notes with me right now to check. Sky Blue and Julia Hart, I apologize for that big mistake. So as I was talking about the beginning of Dynamite, Julia Hart and Sky Blue, and then Willow Nightingale and Chris Dallander making the save there. And at the time, for a second, there was a tease when Mercedes had her back turned and we saw Willow standing there holding a steel chair kind of thinking to herself whether she wasn't sure or not if she wanted to hit Mercedes or not of course Mercedes then turned around and saw Willow holding the chair and then exited the ring you gotta think that we are going to see Mercedes Monday and Willow Nightingale have a match eventually maybe at Dynasty or if they don't want to necessarily save it for a pay-per-view could always have it on an episode of Dynamite or Collision speaking of AEW Collision It will not be airing this Saturday night due to March Madness, unfortunately. So no AEW collision this Saturday night. Gotta remember that. That is all for this Thursday morning episode of Good Morning Wrestling Fans. Thank you, everyone for listening and downloading. Remember, in the comment section, you can leave your thoughts and your opinions and your ratings on last night's AEW Dynamite and AEW Rampage episodes. Hopefully, everyone enjoyed both shows last night. I thought they were both very good shows. Especially if you are in the Toronto area and attended live last night. Hope you had a great time. And once again, thank you for tuning in this morning. Hopefully, we'll be back with more new episodes of 360 Wrestling Fanatic coming at you. And we'll be back tomorrow with the Friday morning episode of 360 Good Morning Wrestling Fans. But until tomorrow morning, have a great pro wrestling day.